Hello everyone, Alpha Soul here and welcome to another video. Now I apologize in advance for the setup as I am in a completely different location because of the COVID-19 virus. I relocated with my family and we are now down in Florida uh, to see this out. We had no interest in being stuck in New York City, so here we are. So I don't have my normal setup, I don't have my green screen or anything like that. So unfortunately the video is kind of going forward until things change a little bit are probably going to have to be a little bit less uh, production value. I mean, I don't really have a lot of production value to begin with, but it is what it is. Anyways, the main purpose of this video is to cover uh, a video that was just recently released and I had been uh, actually working on a completely different video for Lore when this video came out, which is essentially the announcement of the Alpha One early preview, basically. So uh, there is going to be a community event this Friday at, I think it's 11 Pacific Standard Time, so three, uh, no, two on Eastern Time, right? So, uh, and during that preview, we're gonna see a preview of Alpha One, what's been going on, how development has been going. It's going to be a pretty big occasion. Uh, it's what a lot of people have been looking forward to. There have been a couple of naysayers within the community who don't think that things have been progressing, and this will be a chance to kind of ease their expectations. There's been a lot of people talking about it, uh, and within that framework of them announcing this, they actually released a video. I'm going to link it down below, check it out, and it's a preview view of what is to come and I am salivating at what I saw because I liked a lot of what I saw. Um, to begin with, so I'm just going to list off the points that I really enjoyed from it. One, we saw the opening scene of a dwarf uh, riding on this cool looking horse and in general the horses that each of the riders are riding are more detailed you know uh, and have um, you know different ornamentations on them, ornamentations of what we can expect so that was cool but the dwarf in particular we haven't really seen dwarves that much uh, up until now so that was cool to see them in action and see them animated and all that good stuff um, we got to see, which was really cool, the progression of a node from the very beginning when it's just like a tent and stuff like that up until the next stage, up until I think it's a village or something, the third stage basically, and you get to see how it grows uh, of that. So we might be seeing some node stuff in the, uh, in the live stream this Friday, which will be cool. And again, I will cover that immediately after the live stream and make sure that I have a video after that because I'm insanely excited for it. But yeah, we'll see what happens. Um, we got to see buildings as they come up in real time. You kinda, it kind of has this cool construction-like feel. It almost feels like this, um, there are a couple games like Ages of Empires type games, uh, Civilization or uh, even Sim games as they build them. And so that was really cool to see. Um, we got to see a bunch of different uh, creatures as well as combat within it. And the creatures of note, there's this freaky looking frog thing that I think we've seen before, but I don't think we've actually seen animated. There's this troll-like creature uh, that looks kind of like a cross between a troll and a, um, I don't know what to call them, but you know, they've got these, uh, I'm, I'm not sure what to call them, so I'm not gonna butcher it, but it was pretty cool to see those as well too. We got to see a dragons, we got to see different variants of like the bears, and uh, we got to see a stag in action. It was pretty cool. But from a weapon perspective, I really enjoyed that whip that was there uh, in about the middle of the video. You got to see that in action, and that was pretty cool looking. Um, we got to see a bunch of different abilities in play, and we also got to kind of see the tab target nature, and it felt more like a tab target game from looking at it rather than the action portion of it. So I think that will potentially be closer to what we'll see as far as combat, but perhaps we'll see it in person, or sorry, live, if you will, at the upcoming, at the upcoming live stream. So we'll see that, and that'll be interesting to see. Um, and then finally, it, they capped it off with, uh, you know, the dragon flying in, the big dragon fight, and we saw previews of the dragon before, but that'll be pretty interesting to see too. So overall, I am extremely excited. It was a really good preview. It really got everyone excited and the glands wet, if you will. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Let me know what you guys thought about it. I'm curious of what you guys, and again, I will be covering um, the information that they release in as much detail as I possibly can. Um, and that'll be it, all right? I'll see you guys Friday and hope to see you guys on the live stream. Alpha Soul out.